Hey everybody, Omnigriffin here, and welcome back to Subterrain. We are going to continue where we left off. And last time we continued to delve deeper into the casino in hopes of finding our improved engineering software. Alright. And we did a decent job of getting, getting where we needed to be. Now, well, these are recovering... And that's kind of what we're waiting for right now. Uh, we do have a power pack on our hot swap, which I thought was pretty cool that that was a thing, uh, along with our grenades and stuff. Um, but we really need to wait for these. So this is like 50 seconds, so that's not too bad. And the other one is going to be uh, a little bit less. So yeah, we're basically hoping to get engineering level 2 stuff so that we can get like a bigger bag, um... Like, I can make improved medical kits, improved bandages, like, it's very slow, slow, and then we can also put in our better oxygen filters, which suppress infection, which seems like a really good thing. Um, we'll probably have to break down a bunch of old ones and put in new ones, and, oops, we kind of want to... In the Mars, we, we kind of want to apply that to everything. Because we want to get all we want to get all of these down. Because the infection level is like there's some pretty bad stuff going on here. But yeah, that's that's the plan as of right now. But we do want full durability weapons. Check. And that's gonna start repairing. And and also we're gonna be able to make uh, reactor modules Mark II, which is also really awesome. That is something we desire. Because then we can maybe keep more of our stuff online. Because I kind of need to start putting the reactor, or not the reactor, the um, the mine online. The food maybe too. I mean, we're doing okay in terms of finding food and stuff. I'm not worried about that. It's what we can break them down into. Because uh, that's really useful. Cool, that's finished. Um, I'm going to double check here real fast. Whoops. Actually, I'm curious, what's the infection rate here? Zero. And we have no infection rate, so putting a Mark II here doesn't help. Um, I want to look over here. Okay, we don't have... That's odd that we only have one reactor module. I thought we had two. Oh, we do. It's right there. Well, since that's done, we might as well replace it. Like, while we're here. Uh, what's our lowest? 55? 429. Okay, that's not bad. And then when we get back, these will both be ready. I'm really looking forward to those Mark IIs. But we have some progress to make first, so... We gotta get through that casino. Because eventually we need to escape uh, from Mars. We found the plan for the fuel for the rocket. But there's a lot more. Like, I, I'm very confident that we can't just not explore everywhere. And I don't know how bad the attacks are going to get. And I don't know how indefinitely we can stay. Like, just based on how many resources there are. But I guess technically if we're making food... And we can make contamination pills or decontamination pills. We could survive here indefinitely. Hypothetically. We do have to keep my eyes out for yep. defaults, but considering how bad I am at hitting tab when I don't want to, I really should just unbind the whole thing. Wait, no, that's just power. 
Shoot. I have gone in the wrong direction. Yeah, it's over there. I'm just a dummy. I'm wasting power, and I am wasting oxygen and heat, but the heat lasts longer, so I'm probably going to be okay. I mean, we're real close in terms of finding everything. Pretty sure we didn't finish clearing this floor. We just managed to find everything that we needed. Yeah, what's that? That looks like the software that we desire. Okay, just a dead end. I don't know if a shotgun is actually better on these guys. They're so small, and their hitbox is really just a little eye in the middle. So I'm just kind of assuming that it's better. Holy bejeebus. backing up here and there's not going to be anything you can do about it. Well, I managed to get a pretty decent cluster in there, so I figured why not use a grenade. There's still so much stuff in here. Big guy first. It's really hard if this is the G2. like a big version, champion version if you will, it just keeps spitting out the little ones. Oh, and they do fade away. Come at me, bro. Gotcha. All right. I'm not going to close that. Actually, I'm going to open this door first and then run. Good. Empty. Well, not empty. Level 2 mine data chip. That is not what I wanted. I'm actually really disappointed. chair icon. I want these at the top. The A, B, C. We'll read that here in a second. Now I might as well just start taking stuff. We've got one floor left, but... How 
much is weight going to be an issue? I don't know. Because these are a lot of just materials, but they'll just take weight. They're only like two slots though, because they're slot machine chips and casino chips. Oh, I actually ran out of stacks. That's kind of funny. That's not good though. I have slot machine things. Yeah, okay, because there's only stacks of only 50. Fine. So yeah, that's actually really disappointing. That was not what I was hoping to find in here. Because the mine is not something I'm particularly interested in. Well, I might as well take the stairs and finish clearing this place out. Just shaking my head. Not, en engineering is, is so important, and I mean the mine is useful, but it's not as useful as engineering level two. That's right, I need my flashlight now. I see you there. It's a little dangerous looking at these, having not cleared the area. But there are a bunch of doors that are closed, so. I'm hoping this is just all maintenance. Yeah, I did hear that door open. I wasn't going crazy. It was very, very quiet. Shows which way I'm exploring for me. I find it interesting. See? Quick loading power pack was totally worth it. Darn, I want all of those. Okay, that worked out okay, despite how it could have not. I think I'm just putting more slot machine tokens down here. Because I want all of those. guys didn't make it a lot further than I thought they might. Some useful stuff on the ground. I don't think a thermos is useful. Okay, there's nothing of particular value here and then it's just a table. Purified water, which I want but don't have room for. Here, have some tokens. It's very likely that we're coming back here. First stuff, if that room has as much cool things as I think it might. Eight oxygen units. Let's look at this room first. 
I don't want to get caught in a firefight. Oh, yes, please. The rest is what I normally keep. Okay, there's a lot of medical supplies in here, which is really good. Alright, let's go ahead and swap out our oxygen here. First, dodged you. Oh. Really? There were two of you? I had to really hope there wasn't something extra to that was coming up behind me. bottom floor and I don't like that. I heard a bunch of shuffling feet and it was just me getting my feet underneath me basically. Oh my gosh, this place is huge. the elevator. Okay, that's gonna let us not need our flashlight anymore. Which is very good. Very good for us. It's with the amount of combat I'm expecting. Wait, really? We're only on level four? Oh my gosh. I thought this was the last level. Okay. Well, things got a lot more complicated. By complicated, I mean, oh, hello. You stop opening doors. on thermals. Let's check down here. Okay, I've kind of backed myself into a corner here, but that's okay. They don't, they're not so strong. Um, holy crap. Come out of there, please. Oh, geez. I'm trying to switch guns by pressing numbers.
All right, well, let's go ahead and um, head back up to the surface, since I'm such a dummy. Let's recharge your power. Let's uh, maybe drop some stuff off at the tram. If I run into enemies here, I will have some trouble. Well, we cleared out enemy. I don't know how fast they spawn, but I don't think they respawn that fast. Alright, this will fully recharge this one. We'll switch to the other one, charge as much as possible. Now we'll make our trip to the tram, drop off some of this stuff that's got full stacks. Uh, probably any of those casino uh, chips we still have left. Uh, I need to get rid of you. Then we'll head back down, and I'll probably switch out my thermals here. So many stupid chips. And also these cave crystals, because they take up a whole stack all by themselves. Um, apparently, oh, that's infected tissue. That's why that's different. Fine, I've got three scarves. I don't know why. Sure, and since that can't stack with anything else, we'll put it there. Alright. Oh. Uh, how much do I have right now? Zero. Let's, uh, let's get that swapped out, shall we? Alright. Let's go charge up those thermal, or the, uh, the energy one more time, since it should be pretty close to full. It is, in fact, full. That trip was long enough. Now, we are still limited by our oxygen here. Which it, of course, is now complaining about. So that is our time limiter here. Now, of course, if I could just run straight down to the, to the last floor since we found the stairs. Not worry about clearing out the current one that we're on. Which is tempting, because if I find the oxygen... But the oxygen could be on this floor. We've seen that happen before. Where the oxygen's on one floor and the thermals are on the other. We don't have very much left to explore, presumably. Presumably. Now I do still need to finish off of this. That's disconcerting. I should have go into this. I mean the control room at the same time. Hundred percent accuracy and only one extra shot. I'll take it. We have four hours until another mutant invasion. That is not good. We found the oxygen. I don't know if this thing attacks in any particularly special way. You're good. Oxygen generator check. Basically just means we don't have to worry about burning out of that anymore. It doesn't say broken, so... 
I'm not surprised there's nothing useful in here. Really a Jeff Murray figure. Um, I want to get all these medical supplies. Oh my. Such a large space. I do have to really keep an eye on that though. The last invasion wasn't very big, but no, don't you close that. I wanted to check the floor if he dropped anything. Yes, get caught up on that stool. You fool. There could be something useful in here. Besides just tokens. I might be I'd, I'd be wrong, but there could have been. Uh oh, we have to sleep. We're gonna be fighting this zombie invasion with like no preparation. <sighs> Nothing we nope, there is something we haven't explored. Shoot! That is a table. I thought that was an egg or something, and I was like, that's a really weird looking egg for what we're used to. Wow, that took way more bullets than it should have. Like, if I'm gonna have taken the time to get over here, I wanna know. Not gonna argue. Small pillow and pajamas. Oh, how long does it take to get back from here? Was it 25 minutes? 22 minutes? I'm gonna be in a really bad spot. I really should go, but I don't wanna have to come back here. Like, if I don't have to. Man, I'm exhausted. I keep running ever I'm running everywhere happens when you gotta backtrack. That's right, I need to use my flashlight. I should use my shotgun for this. It is way more consistent in terms of how much it's gonna spray and deal damage. I don't have a ton of uh, retreat space, so... so yeah, whenever you're first exploring, yeah, thermal's the next big issue, but it's basically guaranteed to be on this floor, so... Yeah, the gun has to initialize, which is kind of annoying. big one. I don't know how often we're going to see these guys now. They used to be pretty rare, but they've been pretty common of late. Um, excuse me? Why? Oh, the durability's out. Shotguns only now. That's really bad for me.
mostly from a heat standpoint. Certain enemies have now become very hard to deal with. Also large swaths of enemies. That is. None of this is useful. We're getting thirsty, we're getting hungry. Okay. That was dangerous. Excessively so. You take three shots too. An hour and 34 minutes. I gotta go. We gotta go. A, I'm in a bad way here. And B, holy crap, we've been down here forever. So up the stairs we go. I'm gonna grab a drink before I go back and I might eat something too. Depends how hungry we are. We've got the elevator right here and why did that go around that way? We can get out of here relatively quickly and we can get back down there pretty easily. It's just I was really hoping to not have to worry about it. Not the case. Plus we need to sleep. Oh my gosh, we need to sleep. Oh gosh, we need to... Oh, and we need to repair our gun too. We need to do a ton of stuff, and we have an hour to do it once we get in in here. Okay. Uh, real fast. How hungry are we? 53 thirst, 44 hunger. I don't have anything that fits the hunger build just right, so we're going to pass on that. I do have my weaker rifle. I do have that, but I'm going to be using a rifle a lot. So that's the first thing that I'm going to do here. We have 50 minutes. We have 50 minutes. 50 minutes should be a good bit to recover the rifle. I need to eat something. I need to get stuff into the repair. And then I need to sleep. I'm probably going to have to go to the bathroom too. Our energy packs are nice and full because that's going to be really important. Durability on our shotguns is pretty good and pretty even. But this needs to be. Man, I wish we could get that repair speed up. Um, I need to eat something. Cycle. We want research. Why am I looking at the wrong thing? Right, it's in the. It's in the stupid thing. Well, let's eat. Yep, my tiredness has kicked in. Looking for 53. Spaghetti is the right answer. get the research started. Oh god, I've got 15 minutes. I've got 15 minutes.
six. This is gonna go very poorly. Guaranteed. I need to sleep. This is way too low. But I'm only gonna be able to sleep for five minutes. At best. I can't. I don't have time to sleep. Do not have time to sleep. I need to walk, recover my stamina. Yeah, this is the right way. I'm gonna be using grenades is the answer to the question. Okay. Central control generator is under attack, meaning creatures will invade the generator from three directions, meaning we'll try to destroy the generator modules. That uses stamina, so... I don't know if I should be worried about you. Okay. <sighs> All right. Well, everything everything got dealt with. That was once again, luckily, not too bad. All right. So first off, you're going back in here. Um, let's get the G2 back in there too. It's pretty pretty hurt. Um, I'm going to sleep. Actually. Let's look at our reactor status here. Uh, nothing was severely damaged. Alright. I'll take it. I'm going to bed after I go to the bathroom. And then we're calling it an episode. It, it is slight, but I'm going to go to sleep for like eight hours, so... I'm not going to be all that worried. It's probably going to be around eight hours. Hmm. Oh, shoot. No! God damn it. That was a mistake. Um, okay, well, while we're looking then, let's look at all the... Uh, I accidentally tapped an arrow. There's an S or A. I accidentally tapped a button that caused me to move, which kick immediately kicks you out of bed. So let's go ahead and recharge these while I'm waiting. We still got just a little bit of time before I can do those things. Oxygen, thermal. Well, now I can go back to bed. I think the more oh these these actually do have a limit on them. It's just so high. All right, back to bed. We we had some slightly not restful sleep. All right, I'm, my hands are off the keyboard. Mmm, glorious sleep. Glorious, glorious sleep. So yeah, your stamina doesn't start getting affected uh, until you're pretty far into sleep. It gets affected very quickly, and then it takes a long time to recover. So, I mean, I'm okay with that. That was weird. Alright, uh, how's our research doing? Pretty close. Okay, so we need to read this. Uh, hey boss, should I bring the data chip to the high roller poker match at Leo? Also, we took care of the troublemaker from that other night, if you know what I mean. 
Wow. Can't, like, seriously learn to write. We just say he did involuntarily exit out the airlock. He he. Just to make sure you know we did kill him, boss. Wow, that's, uh... Yep. I have no damn idea what you're trying to say, you stupid gorilla. If you're talking about the data chip, yes, bring it to the poker match in Leo. And don't talk about private matters and emails again, you dolt. Yes, boss. Sorry, boss. Okay, so, uh, Leo. That's where we're going next. I mean, obviously the game is designed to lead us down this path. We got the mine improvement, but we're really looking for the engineering chip, which is what I th it sounded like we were doing before. But anyway, I'm going to save the game here and say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We got a surprise zombie invasion even. So, you know, that's always fun. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next time. And until then, keep your ears turning.